In efforts to produce graduates who meet the needs of the industry and create jobs, technical vocational education and training institutions have received a boost through provision of state-of-the-art equipment. Through Phase 1 of Kenya-China partnership, implemented by AVIC International Holding Corporation, 10 Tibet institutions received modern equipment in three disciplines, including rapid prototyping, mechanical technology, and electrical and electronics. Through the experiences that we've got with the students and the community around is that uh, uh, the trainers and the trainees have been able to, to, to support on the better agenda on housing, where we have been able to have our students uh, fabricate chairs, fabricate windows, gates. We have uh, the electricians who are also involved in that. We have the builders. We also have uh, that team in uh, plumbing that are doing a great deal while using this equipment. It has really impacted the, our teaching and made our teaching so easy because of the tools that they donated and even the equipment they installed, like the uh, gas welding equipment, uh, compressor, and some of the tools that we are using to repair and maintain vehicles. Neza tangeneza murango, dirisha, neza tangeneza grill, adi some places tunapia wa kazi, tunayena tunafanya na some student. In the second phase, 144 institutions received state-of-the-art equipment in 10 disciplines, including electrical and electronics, civil and building technology, mechanical technology, automotive technology, refrigeration and air conditioning, agriculture, machinery, agriculture value addition, hospitality management, mechatronics technology, and welding and fabrications. Since we got the machines, that is around March, we have trained uh, around nine cohorts of trainees, and uh, we usually give them a one-week training. And after that one-week training, we have a four-week mentorship. So far, we have uh, around 600, six, six students who have earned more than $400. In time packs, so far, I've earned uh, $4. But in the, the current one, that is this week, but the last week I earned, I uh, withdrew around uh, $20 from time packs. Apart from that, I also do forex trading. I went through a training um, on financial markets and trading. I was able to earn $90 as per now for the past three months. We have a hydraulic system. It is well equipped. It helps us in medi medical engineering department, like when we use the anesthetic machines. It is also helpful in that manner. This project was implemented across all the 47 counties, ensuring youth have access to modern and industry-relevant skills for the 21st century. <laughs> President William Ruto is expected to lead the Kenya delegation to the Forum on China-Africa Cooperation Summit next month in Beijing, where Kenya is expected to sign more deals within and beyond the education sector. The TVET partnership is aimed at improving the socio-economic conditions of the young people while empowering Nairobi's industrial and technical capabilities.